In the past few weeks, London along with many areas across the world was hit with a heat wave, and what normally follows this is a thunderstorm, because moisture and warmth are crucial to thunderstorms. Last week one resident in London decided to film the recent storm, but when going back and looking at the footage, she said that something could be seen in the background. Looking closer, she said that black objects could be seen when the sky was lit up, and that upon close inspection it appeared to be a black triangle. The images were posted to her Facebook account, where she asked if anyone else had seen the object, but most people were asleep at this point as the storm happened early in the morning. She said the following, As I was watching the lightning, I decided to record it on my phone for some family members who are on holiday. I stayed out there for around 20 minutes, and got a good clip of the lightning just above my housing estate. As I went in and looked through the clips I saw what appeared to be an object in the background, so I uploaded the footage to my laptop in order to investigate what this was. After editing the clip and stopping it during one of the flashes, I could see a semi-transparent black triangle in the background. We have RAF bases all around the south, so I thought that it may have been a jet or something from one of the nearby bases, but strangely the objects didn't really move throughout the entire clip, and there's multiple times when I could see it sitting in the same area. This made me think that it wasn't something like a balloon or a bin bag, as it would have moved on fairly quickly. Interestingly, she isn't the first person to capture one of these crafts on camera, and it's led amateur researchers to label these aircrafts as a type of black project aircraft. Debates have gone on for years in regards to who owns these aircrafts, with some saying that the military is in possession of them, while others have said that an unknown branch of the military is in possession of them. Those who saw this photograph then went on to detail their sightings, said that they've witnessed something that looked very similar to this, and again labelled it as a mysterious black triangle. For those unaware, these triangular aircrafts have been reported all across the world, and according to data gathered by the military, they're most commonly seen above the United States and the United Kingdom, but they've also been sighted above Turkey, Iceland, New Zealand, Australia and Canada. As of right now, no military has come forward and said they're in possession of these aircrafts, which in turn has led to speculation about who owns these things, and where the tech came from. These black triangles have been observed doing things that conventional aircrafts can't do. For example, hovering motionless in the sky without making a sound, using cloaking technology, having the ability to make their way into restricted airspace, having a fascination with military bases, especially ones that are in possession of nuclear warheads, and being able to fly at tens of thousands of miles per hour. One aviation enthusiast said the following, We know that these things exist, but right now there's still many unanswered questions. No one has come forward to own up to these things, and that's strange when you remember that they've been encountered since at least the 90s. There's reports that are said to go back even earlier, so you're talking about a craft that's been encountered for at least 30 years, and yet we don't know any more about it, except that it's still being sighted to this day, and it's one of the most common aircrafts that we know little about. Usually after 30 or 40 years an aircraft like this will become known to the public, but as each year goes on these aircrafts become more and more mysterious. Another user said the following, I feel like even if these things do belong to us, then where did they come from? How can we make such a leap forward that we go from the Wright brothers to these aircrafts in only a few decades? These things have been encountered now for over 40 years, and that doesn't include sightings by everyday people which can be tracked back even further. I just struggle to understand where this tech comes from because it's not universal. It's not like we're seeing this kind of leap forward in other industries. We're still flying in commercial aircrafts which haven't really changed much. I was talking to someone a while back about this, and commercial planes really haven't changed in the past 45 years. They're constructed slightly differently, but the overall look and the way they move hasn't changed. 
I'm having people tell me that these aircrafts are part of an unknown project, and that would make sense if we're also seeing this leap forward in other areas, but we're not. As of right now, more and more of these aircrafts are being captured on camera, but although we have evidence of them and know they've been spotted for several decades, it seems that we're no closer to understanding what they are, what type of propulsion system they use, and where they're coming from, and who actually owns them. With the topic of mysterious aircrafts being featured in the mainstream media, perhaps in the near future we'll have a better understanding of what these aircrafts are, and what it means for the future of humanity. So what do you make of this interesting photograph, and what do you think it shows? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.